<laughs> my ears. Yes. The question is, can we lower it maybe? From here. Sound effects. Maybe that's better. Human noodle or human being? Human noodle. Because I normally like to sit weirdly and now I'm supposed to, you know, sit posture well and... Me. Look at this thing that you found. What did you find? I just needed you to know. I love you. Alright. I guess this is the place. Where we are supposed to be, so we could go downstairs and check if they have something nice in there. What? We got the boosted stream challenge at Monday? What the fuck? That, that's a nice change. That is a big nice change. What the fuck? I've got so used to it that we only get them, you know when it's day off the next day or something Wait. it's a weapon to surpass metal gear mm -hmm. oh fucking hell okay so here was something okay so here the place that i avoided because i didn't want to go there because I thought it's forward was fucking that. Uh... Okay. 30% done already. What the fuck? Okay then. Well, well then. Yeah, I ain't going there. Fuck that. <laughs> Time to eat the challenge. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Very good loading screens. Alright. So now we go up here. <laughs> Need the challenge in Goblin. Yep! Alright, uh, F6 was quick save. Yes. Hello, sir. So cute. You look incredible. Ah, oh, thank you. I also was checking, like, my old, um, clips today and like my makeup skills have gotten better my freaking english has gotten way better uh the way how i act is more natural on streams i don't look always so like ah, everything is gonna go horribly wrong and then the thing that i have started to like be able to take compliments better yeah it isn't still great but we are getting there, little by little. You see that? So tomorrow you will finally There's not a look like a homeless person. You will actually be wearing pants without holes. That's nice. Soon it's gonna be tomorrow. You looking great as always. Oh, thank you. You're more confident, I guess. Yeah, way more confident right than I used to be. Like, way more confident. And more natural as well. Progress is good. Yes. Also, my aim has gotten way better. Like, way better. Like, seriously. And the biggest change is that... Uh, well, people who have been here since the very beginning probably remember how I used to get scared by everything in horror games. Like, something moved. My own shadow, I got scared by it. Now I'm like, jump scare up here, try harder next time. So it has changed quite a lot as well. This is your favorite gun in Half-Life 1. For a good reason, it's a pretty nice weapon. So yeah, it's a huge change. Also checked my posture, like I... It has gotten better now since I start to actually try to change it. It's still a long process to actually make it good enough. Hello, sir. Yeah. 
fucking hell. Okay, that looks like we are going forward through there. Gee, that guy came out and over, it just ran past you. Yeah. I don't know what was his issue. Maybe he didn't want you to fight with us. Hi, Tetris. How are you today? Okay. There's so many places where I could go. Ah, uh, shiny. Not too bad. Happy to hear. I still remember getting here because Resident Evil 4 feel long ago, yet it feels not that long ago at the same time. Uh, aha, I teleported. Um, okay. Can we teleport something else in there? No. Okay, so is it like only one away? Yeah, I guess it's only one way there. Weird. Boop. Good day in between meetings. Happy poke the tentacle to day high. Good luck on the run and don't try to break the game too much. I like everything you see, you look gorgeous and mega fun. Oh, thank you. But yeah, I never try to break the game. I don't even know what would happen if I would try since, you know, if I break games this fast without trying, how much they would break if I would actually try? That is like a fucking terrifying thought, not gonna lie. Well, let's let's not, you know, poke it. Alright. So there is something down there. Alright. You should try that someday. Probably. There's still time for one to two presses. Well, those we probably will get eventually, to be fair. There should be a tester. Ah, maybe one day. Hopefully. It would be a dream job, but at the same time, like, it would actually mean that I need to, you know, be able to work properly. Because I feel like that's not something you can cancel because you feel like shit. So. I'm... I think I have once consult stream because I felt like shit, but and once in whole three years I've. Yeah. When was that? Ah, uh, it was back in the time when I still had my old camera set up. So, quite a long time ago. You've never seen it. Yeah. I have had to be pretty damn sick that I would actually, you know, cancel a stream, to be fair. Pretty damn sick. <clears throat> uh, we might have gone through a conversation with Jepuski the other day when I was feeling like, you know, one of those feels when you know that you're gonna get a fucking massive migraine or something. And I felt dizzy and slightly like a feverish. And he was like, okay, well, you can cancel the stream. And I was like, no! Half hours until the stream. I ain't canceling shit. He was like, "Why not?" And I was like, "No, that's too late. You know, you can't cancel a stream at half hour before. Like, it's not how it works. You have to cancel it at least like an hour or two before it." And he's like, "Says who?" Oh fuck, I pressed the wrong button. I was per no. Oh well. Up oh, that exactly you. Mm -hmm. By the way, you was feeling crappy yesterday, but installed Subnautica below zero and sunk in there for a few hours feel better. Well I'm happy to hear that it helped. By the way, how's the back queue? Ah uh, it's better now. It's, it's just like one of those stuff that it gets super bad. Uh sometimes it gets so bad that I can't walk. And then the next day it's gonna be fine and, you know, no pain anymore. I don't know why it does that. But yes, I do plan to get that mashas eventually. I just need to, you know, collect money to be actually able to get it. Besides, it costs money and... Yeah. 
that isn't something I can currently afford at all. Okay. Also, how is Red Lotus today? Okay, so there was stairs. Saved. Sniff. Sad queen noises. Mm. I'm feeling that I'm once again I'm lost. Not really lost, but not exactly where I'm supposed to be. Say it that way. Okay, just notice that you have to pay a fine for driving over the speed limit somewhere. At some time earlier this year, and no other information. What the fuck? There should be other information as well, where it happened and why... Uh, what place signs? That sounds quite a... Sketchy. That sounds weird. Okay, what the actual fuck happened over there? Question, are pancakes supposed to be as thick as your index finger? You think you may have done something wrong? No, they are supposed to be even thicker. At least the finished pancakes, like, uh, they are pretty damn thick. So, it's fine. Don't worry, you didn't fuck up anything. Quite a suspicious, indeed. In your 16 plus, 12 plus of driving, you had only one such a case and you received all the needed details. Uh, can you, like, ask more details about it or do you have to, you know... Just paid or so. Speeding camera once flashed for you. You was like, fuck, no, fine. Never came, so you guess you locked out. Yeah, here. Fun fact here. If the police doesn't send the ticket about driving over speed in two weeks, they can't send it anymore. It's illegal at that point. And yes, I might have uh, used one night reading about laws about that because of reasons a few years ago. <laughs> Hi, Andy Klaus and Tui and Senor Grant, how are you all? Yeah, I... Yeah, I got tickets, so I read everything. Oh, well, I was supposed to get a ticket, so I read everything and I was super scared and I couldn't sleep, so yeah. You spent the last couple of hours practicing every single one of your instruments. Ooh, that's awesome. You have too many. How many you have and what do you have? But the girl might pop up any later, otherwise good luck and have fun. <laughs> Okay, have an amazing rest of your day, Derp. I hope that the work goes well. You plan to go on an escalator today. The whole situation is weird AF. Yes. Your thieves are part of your skeleton too. They contain calcium and minerals like bones, but they lack collagen, which gives bones flexibility and strength. Okay. But yeah, I got speed t speed ticket once. Yes, once. And um, I thought it's a uh, well, it was a new road where I was driving, and I thought that the area would be like um, higher speed than it actually were. And I got ticket from driving six kilometers over speed, which uh, well, wait, it was seven kilometers over speed. And if I would have been driving six, I would have only got the warning. So I had to pay 200 euros of that. Sucked, sucked as big time, so there were 
police car raiding for me in there. But yeah, happens. Uh, but yeah, then I read about uh, laws quite a lot in the next <clears throat> couple of nights and learned a lot of stuff. Like the portal? It's a nice portal. Hi, Lekola. How are you today? You have never had a ticket in the 13 plus years. You had your driver's license, no speeding tickets, no parking ticket, etc. So we get random skeleton packs too now. Yes! You have eight instruments. You have got two harmonicas, an ocarina, a bass, electric guitar, acoustic guitar, one drum, and one cymbal, and one synthesizer. Ooh, no! Yeah, here the lowest price is pretty much like a 200 euros for a speed ticket. The funny thing. Uh, doesn't Finland have uh, like income based, based traffic tickets? Yes, but it starts from 200 euros. It used to be uh, starting from 70 euros, but they lift it up even though it's quite a. Yeah, they lift it up with uh, almost 100 euros higher. But yeah. And back in that time, I wasn't working, so yep. It was fun. Extremely fun. Okay. And um, like that was actually the only time when I was living uh, like thriving in normal speed. I thought it's a, <laughs> a different road. So yeah, I'm happy that I got the ticket from that and not driving actually 100 kilometers over speed. That would have sucked ass. You found out about it when you was watching the Dudesons and they got like 5,000 euro ticket for doing 20 over the limit. Yep. I am not sure how the fuck am I supposed to see the place where I need to go. Fucking earth do I need to go? Oh here. Okay. You want one of those Scandinavian mobiles that don't get all shitty in winter time. They do still get shitty in winter time. Every car gets eventually. You had to pay about 230 euros last time, calculated based on how much kilometers over the limit you was driving. It was 20 at the time. But that was because you paid the fine less than two weeks after you received the ticket. Otherwise, the fine would have been almost 350. I don't think here it gets higher if you don't uh, pay it in certain amount of time. At least back in that time, when I was reading about it, there was nothing about uh, paying it like that. Pizza guy. You hated this part. It was really tricky. Oh, okay. You have never had a ticket or even pulled over. I've never been pulled over. Never. But yeah, ticket I got. <laughs> Queen got the speeding ticket, but on earth. Uh, I used to have um, hmm, issues with the over speed because when there was no one in the road. I would not want to stick around too long, Doc. Sorry, it's faster to than like anyone. An and apparently we that drives are. into the family like everyone else mean? has uh, same issue. But yeah, I was really addicted with the adrenaline doses. Like, had to get it. Because it was the only time when I would feel that I am alive. And hi Telesia, how are you today? This is just your lovely theory, but you think it 
if the bad guys got finished, chocolate they would want peace with humanity. Exactly. Wait, you have gotten finished chocolate? You have gotten a speeding ticket once. Unfortunately, it was because the speedometer on your mom's car was slightly off. Apparently, that isn't a valid excuse. Oh, You've been pulled over a few times, but that was because you often working until midnight and the policemen are getting very cautious about people driving drunk at this time of the day. Fair. Very fair. Wait. Was I supposed to do something with these bug faces here? Hi, Larry. How are you today? Fatser is. It's the best chocolate. If I remember right, they changed the name of the Fatser's blue chocolate. And now it's just something else. Don't know why. Which person that nice. You alright? <laughs> Happy to hear. Nothing of okay. Take it back. You think? Ah, uh, Gensha. Ah, uh, Geisha. You mean? Does anyone know if we can get finished chocolate in the US? I think you can actually order it from Amazon. If I'm not completely mistaken, at least there was at some point a chance to order it from Amazon. And you can actually order different types of it as well. You can't get arrested if you hit the pause button and just play around in the menu long enough eventually they just lose patience. Wait, what? Okay, so it's chocolate. Uh, yes. Found it. Nice. But yeah, uh, Fatser is blue. That is... Yeah, I'm boring. That's my favorite. Mm, then there is stuff like... Kismets and Geisha and... What nuts. And I actually sent one packet of candies to my friend in China. And he freaking loved the chocolate. Uh, there was even my favorite candies, which are like basically salt licorice coated with chocolate. It's fucking delicious. You have had Carl's Fudger chocolate. Ooh, what's up with Finnish chocolate? It good? Yeah, it's good. And a lot of people do say that it's so good because like um, a lot of other chocolates use milk powder on them, but Carl Fatzer uses like um, fresh milk for them. I don't know where the fuck am I supposed to get them. You can get this in some stores there. Ooh, nice. Guess a caramel and salt. Sea salt, so fucking good. I have not tasted it. But your blue and red are the best. You mean talosukla? You don't think you could eat tupla. You just can't do black licorice. I don't like tuplas. But... In China, yeah. I have friends all over the world. Well, you have. Well, you live only a few miles from DC, so you're not all that surprised. Mm, fair. If all Carl Fatser find like, well, yeah, or whatever the spelling is, chocolate. Ah, uh, Geisha? Maybe? For some reason, you just got some cravings for chocolate. Wonder why? Yeah. No, no idea. <laughs> sneakers for the win. I don't like sneakers. But to be fair, I'm really. How would I say? Boring what comes to my chocolate taste. Like, really boring. It's Gevalia. What is that? That doesn't sound familiar for me at all. She's queen of skeletons. Of course, she have allies all over the world. Yes. The sad part about the chocolate, though, is that I can't eat it. I'm allergic to it. I can't eat it. Gevalia was the coffee brand. Let's see. Where in the fucking earth do I need to go? What the fuck? 
lactose intolerance, and so you can't barely have any yourself. Understandable. There is the pills, though. The pills that you can eat anything you want with those pills. For lactose-free people. Wait, now you're thinking about similar name brand. Huh? Okay. Could someone please explain this part? Where in the fucking earth am I supposed to go? Because I'm starting to be really confused. We got up here. But now we are still in the wrong place. I don't understand. Chiradelli. Never heard of that one. Never heard of that one at all. I'm just about to think it with Portal Screen. Uh, I do recognize Portal Reference. But we got up there already. Like we got to the highest part. Uh, Radix, I'm asking for real. Like what am I supposed to do at this point? Because I got to the highest part. And then there was nothing at all. So am I in the wrong place or was I supposed to press something? You remember this part but you don't remember what you are supposed to do. Yeah. This is so fucking confusing. Fine Anakin. Ah. This is different from vanilla Half-Life. This is the Black Mesa. Oh no, what the fuck was that? I guess that is the place where I need to go. So maybe. F6. By the way, Queen, you have 50% to tattoo. Ooh. Nice. You're going to get it soon. Okay, I think I'm in the right place now. I think, maybe. Maybe. I think so. All right. Well, fucking hell, nice. Who designed all these rooms like death traps? Yes! Okay, I need to say hydration is at optimal levels. Hi Par Par Par, how are you today? Love you all. Aw, love you too. Okay, so jumping doesn't work. Okay, that's awesome. Didn't want to jump anyway. This is the same place where we were. Is this a fucking time? To okay, that's great. <laughs> there is glasses on the what? Women need to call Osha. You bet it was Jimin. 
I have no idea what you're talking. I like how this is basically both time and jumping person. Yeah. Got the lobby. Okay, now we are here. I guess we save up. Hopefully. Learned OSHA compliance by evolving OSHA rules. I have no idea what you're talking at all. I'm scared. Is the occupation a safety hazard association? Uh -huh. By the way, what's the game portal based on those portals? Don't know. Hi Metal Pheasant, how are you today? This bit giving you finished quick flashbacks. Ah no, not really. This is way nicer. Very nicer. There are like safety in business. Yep, I'm not familiar with that at all. This pistol. Both franchises are in the same universe, so they are pr particularly connected. Okay. Guess not. You're also right. not familiar with safety. This way, Doctor Freeman. Yeah. Part of was originally a student game project called Not a Particular Trope. All brought the team in and event. To a product plus portal. Oh. Okay, either you're not fully awake or your coffee has developed the ability to teleport. Or both. Could be. 59%. Yes. 